Sweet the memory is to me Of a land beyond the sea, Where the waves and mountains meet, Where, amid her mulberry trees, Sits Amalfi in the heat, Bathing ever her white feet In the tideless summer seas. In the middle of the town, From its fountains in the hills, Tumbling through the narrow gorge, The canetto rushes down, Turns the great wheels of the mills, Lifts the hammers of the forge. Tis a stairway, not a street, That ascends the deep ravine Where the torrent leaps between rocky walls That almost meet. Toiling up from stair to stair, Peasant girls their burdens bear, Sunburnt daughters of the soil, Stately figures tall and straight, What inexorable fate Dooms them to this life of toil? Lord of vineyards and of lands, Far above the convent stands, On its terraced walk aloof Leans a monk with folded hands, Placid, satisfied, serene, Looking down upon the scene, Over wall and red-tiled roof, Wondering unto what good end All this toil and traffic tend, And why all men cannot be Free from care and free from pain, and the sordid love of gain, and as indolent as he. Where are now the freighted barks from the marts of east and west? Where the knights in iron sarks journeying to the holy land, glove of steel upon the hand, cross of crimson on the breast? Where the pomp of camp and court? Where the pilgrims with their prayers? Where the merchants with their wares and their gallant brigantines, Sailing safely into port, chased by corsair algerines, Vanished like a fleet of cloud, like a passing trumpet blast, Are those splendours of the past, and the commerce, and the crowd, Fathoms deep beneath the seas lie the ancient wharves and quays, Swallowed by the engulfing waves, Silent streets and vacant halls, Ruined roofs and towers and walls, Hidden from all mortal eyes, Deep the sunken city lies, Even cities have their graves. This is an enchanted land, Round the headlands far away, Sweeps the blue Salernian bay With its sickle of white sand. Further still and furthermost on the dim discovered coast, Pystum with its ruins lies, And its roses, all in bloom, Seem to tinge the fatal skies Of that lonely land of doom. On his terrace high in air, Nothing doth the good monk care For such worldly themes as these. From the garden just below, Little puffs of perfume blow, and a sound is in his ears of the murmur of the bees in the shining chestnut trees. Nothing else he heeds or hears. All the landscape seems to swoon in the happy afternoon. Slowly, o'er his senses, creep the encroaching waves of sleep, and he sinks as sank the town, unresisting fathoms down into caverns cool and deep. Walled about with drifts of snow, Hearing the fierce north wind blow, Seeing all the landscape white And the river cased in ice, Comes this memory of delight, Comes this vision unto me Of a long-lost paradise In the land beyond the sea. End of poem. <laughs>